That's really rough. I mean, her entire life, her entire being has been dedicated to <sighs> trying to stop this evil that has been prophesized for, you know, ages and ages. And she has sacrificed so much and endured so much and had to be someone she's not for so long that uh, to, to really just be robbed of her agency, her importance, by not being able to harness this power and having everyone die, have all the consequences be heaped onto everyone else as a result of her a her failure to a activate this power first that is supposedly lying dormant within her. I can't even imagine the, the just the overall, I don't know, inner struggle, pain, misery, uh, it just, take your pick of the descriptive words it's just your entire life is pointless your entire life as everybody has stated this is your purpose this is what you're supposed to do you, you, you need not fail you fail your whole life everyone has been te training you for this moment has been teaching you for this moment and you are unable to follow through to succeed I don't know just that overall feeling. This is probably has to be one of the most heart-wrenching uh, depictions of Zelda in like any any game, any Zelda game to date. This is the Zelda that failed. This is the Zelda that could not live up to the legend of her namesake. It's rough. This is the first time I think in a Zelda game where they allowed Zelda to fail. Now. Given that, given the state of this world, that a hundred years later, Link is awake and is going to have to clear the, you know, clear up uh, the mess that uh, Ganon has made and that uh, Zelda has just barely saved everyone from, um, we will see that her power actually does activate, but it activates for a very specific reason at a very specific time, and honestly, not a moment too soon. Yep, he's running with his donkey, ain't he? Whew. Looks like it's lightening up finally. Goodness. So we're backtracking slightly, but this time we're going up the hill instead of down this hill. We're headed back into Kakriko Village. And good thing too, because now we need to gather together all the things, uh, tell Impa that uh, we have recovered most of our, if not all of our memory, and for pity sake, really. Let's see here. Oh, I see it. Oh, you had to do that, huh? So I'm going to be heading northwards, I believe, to, hmm, no, we're going to have to actually head south first, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, we did get that chest. I'd forgotten that we had bombed that. It's been so long ago since we went through this area the first time, I had forgotten. Yep, and we did get that uh, Korok there. Is there, yep, there is the beetle on the tree, the energetic rhino beetle. There's two that pop up. This is one of them. Can't believe I've never caught one of those before in this stream, but it is what it is. What's up, Pi? I'm gonna totally steal all these apples. <laughs> Huh? 
Let her know that we recovered all of our memories. Yes, we have. Took us a long time. Took us like 40, 40 something days. Our final memory. Oh, this is the first time where she's actually gotten up and walked around. Even Link's kind of mildly surprised there. wonder how this picture was taken, if it was painted. How did they print it out? Hmm. So there's two things you can do here. You can just go straight to the area that this depicts. Um, or you can take a picture of it and uh, then follow the picture and figure out where, where it's uh, located. And yay, we got a champion's tunic. don't think we're going to be able to... <sighs> yeah, the tunic is... Even if we upgrade it by one, it's going to be nowhere near, because I, I would need Farash's... Yeah. Anyway, so that is on the plains. That is just south of Kakriko. So we're actually going to go above, possibly through the fairy fountain again. So one of the suits that I have found to be super insanely helpful in master mode has actually been surprisingly the Sheikah suit, the uh, stealth guard. That has been a surprising boon, uh, in all senses of the word, in master mode. Okay, I need more fairies. This is like one of the few chances I can get fairies, gosh darn it. So I'm going to use the exploit. Not the glitch, but the exploit. We're carrying fairies into the area. Makes more appear. So there's three I see, so that gives me at least a total of s four. I'll get you later. All right. Come on, come on, come on, thank you. And finally, the last one. Because we all know I need fairies. I die so often. Please go lower, fairy. Please go lower. What are you doing? <sighs> so of course it goes higher. Why why would it want to listen to me? Is it where is it going? Where is it going? Can I grab it off this way? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Whew, all right. So we got ourselves seven fairies. Hopefully, I don't need to lose any uh, between here and the castle. All right. Yes, silent. Not three silent princesses. It's not gonna make too much of a difference in the long run. And my my knight's armor is better than that. So what do we need next? Two ferocious horn. Right. That means we actually have to encounter Farash on two separate days between now and the next time we get to a fairy fountain, which is not going to be that likely. All right, so actually we can go straight up and over actually. I think this is going to be the last time we go to this fairy fountain, and honestly, I think that's the last time, period. Oh my. I better be extra careful. Extra, extra careful.
Okay, up and over, up and over. So, most of this exterior feature around Kakariko is a little bit featureless, minus the pillar monoliths of stone. But it's, uh, it's an interesting area nonetheless. Okay, I think that is my goal down there. And you're blocking me from my goal, Boko. Okay, so there is the stables, there is the planes, and now we are going straight to the last memory, sans the Master Sword one. So other than that one, Link will have recovered all of his memories. It's almost like I could have sworn I've done this before. <laughs> I left off of this and headed to and headed towards these planes by gliding. I could have sworn I did this. Wow. They're all sleeping down there, aren't they? Three reds, four reds, five reds, one blue or black, and then a silver. Okay, where is it? It's here somewhere. Right here. Oh my gosh, finding this final memory was insanely hard. I was wandering all over the, the place, you know, just trying to figure out where the heck is this thing. Bomb of sorts. What was that? Oh. No, Link, get up. <coughs> no, he's just fine. He doesn't believe her. Fee was talking to her just then. Princess, are you all right? Take Link to the Shrine of Resurrection. If you don't get him there immediately, we are going to lose him forever. Is that clear? So make haste and go. His life is now in your hands. Oof. So, Fee, the spirit of the Master Sword, makes a small guest appearance in this game as a little voice that speaks to Zelda in that moment Link. to let him know that he still can be saved. Link. Link. You have recovered all of your memories of us. 
from 100 years ago. I am here, inside Hyrule Castle. It is now time for you to defeat Ganon. Complete. Now we need to figure out where we're going next. Because where we're going means a lot. I want to say we go this way up those cliffs. Because before we go to the Master Sword, we have one last thing we need to do. We have one more tower and one more stable to, look, to explore. So we can round out the entire map of Hyrule and all that stuff. And look, there's a Korok here. I think it's acorns you have to, you have to do in that one. All right, getting up there is going to be a little tricky. We don't have Rivali's kale. Oh my goodness. How are we going to do this? Uh, could possibly go up that way. Do you see what I see? I do. Up that way, depending. Oh. Okay. This was a lot steeper than I was expecting it to be. And this is why <laughs> we got stamina. Oh my goodness. Really? Oh, ho, 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 oh, that was a nice little exploit if I ever did see one. Okay, Whew, we made it all the way from down there to the Blatchery Plain. Mm -mm. All right, up we go, everybody, up we go.